All right, on this part of the build, I'm gonna make the uh, caliper bracket for the rear. Um, this is the rear wheel I used. I'm using, it's just a 12 inch pit bike wheel. Bought this one off of Alibaba.com. It's a 1.85 by 12. Rear sprocket is from PBI Sprockets. Um, check out the last video I put out about wheels for more information about these wheels. Uh, this is a 210 millimeter rotor um, for if you just look up pit bike or small dirt bike. Um, I got these from I got this one and the caliper from PCC Motors on eBay. They are out of California. They seem to be an importer for a lot of these Chinese bike parts. So I'm going to use this piece of steel and part of this existing bracket. Uh, I won't use this masher cylinder. So I'm going to start by pulling all the fluid out of the system, getting rid of this masher cylinder, getting that out of the way. And then I'll drill my 15 millimeter axle hole in this bracket and this piece of steel to start making my bracket and radius the end. Got the brake rotor bolted down to the wheel. I'm gonna take this piece of speaker wire and tape it to the edge of the rotor to give me the proper spacing away from the rotor for the brake caliper so it doesn't rub on the inside. This is just speaker wire. It's about the same thickness as the rotor. It's going to be different for different calipers, but this seems to get me the right spacing that I need for this setup. Then I got this 15 millimeter hole drilled in the end of this piece of 3 16 flat stock and then radiused. So I marked and cut off part of that existing bracket that came with the caliper and ground it so it would all match up to this extra piece here that I'm making. So I got everything lined up where I want it. And then mark some reference lines so that I can clamp it down, put a couple of tack welds on it, and then I cut off this extra length, and then I can mock it all up again, make sure it's all gonna work, and then finish welding it. I'll also probably lay a overlay right here to reinforce it. All right, put put a couple of tack welds on this hold it in place so I can test fit it one more time. That looks perfect. Yeah, that looks good. So I can go ahead and finish welding this up. So I got the bracket all welded up. Made this overlay piece just to, it's probably overkill, but it don't hurt to make it a little stronger. Um, this is basically what my setup is, is that axle goes through here, brake caliper, and then I run a uh, 3 
tie link to a bracket that's welded to the frame. So I got the mounting tab just tack welded in place. But here you can get a good idea of what the assembled brake looks like.